Good evening, everybody. Thanks for joining us this evening. The city of Grand Junction held a meeting earlier this evening to show the public what the new community recreation center might look like. The head designers showed their ideas as well as some alternate proposals for additional rooms or activities. Our reporter Jeff Hinkle was at that meeting earlier today and got to hear what the designers had to say about the project. Jeff, what kind of things are going to be going on in the rec center? Yeah, well, it's not going to be like anything we've ever seen here on the Western Slope, that's for sure. The Community Recreation Center will have a little bit of everything for everyone, and it's been in consideration for a very long time. This isn't a community-wide effort that goes back all the way to 1979. So there are people in this community that have been dreaming of a community recreation center for 45 years. Grand Junction's newest spot for sports and recreation now has renderings of what the inside of the building could look like. From community rooms to not one, but maybe even two climbing walls, this recreation center has a little bit of everything for everyone. Aww. The main goal of the recreation center is to get people in the door and living a healthier lifestyle. When folks come into the new recreation center, whether they voted for it or they voted against it or didn't vote, they, they can feel a connection to it and hopefully uh, use it because that's what it's all about. It's all about serving the community and the more people that we can get active and healthy and connecting with one another. Here's a look at the new recreation center renderings that were presented at the meeting with many different rooms being built into this space like a community room or climbing walls to pool spaces and basketball courts. The center boasts a lot of natural light with huge windows lining the entryway and space for all kinds of activities. Although, while construction will begin this year, according to Sherbino, we still need to be a little patient for the center to be fully completed. The groundbreaking will take place on June 1st, and then Sherbino outlined what a potential timeline might look like. After that event on June 1st, it's going to take about two years to construct, and we're looking to open the building to the community in the middle of 2026. Sherbino also said that the main goals of construction are going to be staying on time and staying on budget. All right, thanks, Jeff. The groundbreaking is the next scheduled event for the Community Recreation Center, and Sherbino says it'll be fun for the whole family.